What's up guys, this is Merc Music and welcome to Black Ops 3 Mythbusters. It's kind of like that show Mythbusters except Black Ops 3. Let's do this. Myth. The crossbow's bayonet attachment can knife people faster than the combat knife. I decided to do two different tests. The first test is just me knifing the air 10 times with the crossbow's bayonet attachment and the combat knife and trying to figure out which of the two has a faster recovery time. I was actually pretty surprised to see that the combat knife is faster than the bayonet, but we're not celebrating after hitting a trick shot or getting a nuke, so let's stab some enemies. The second test is seven knife kills with the combat knife and the bayonet to see which one's faster. You'll instantly notice that the combat knife recovers pretty fast when you're not knifing anything, but the second you start to knife enemies, it's pretty slow. The bayonet attachment can actually knife seven enemies faster than the combat knife can, but you have to consider that if you accidentally miss, that you're going to have a slower recovery time before you can knife someone else. I think it's safe to say that this myth is confirmed. The bayonet attachment can knife enemies faster than the combat knife. Honestly, now that I think about it, the crossbow with the bayonet attachment is a lot like the ballistic knife. Let's see if they share any other similarities. Myth. The crossbow can destroy a Hellstorm missile. This one's gonna be tough. We have to do it multiple times, maybe, so... Yeah, I know. Yep. All right, ready? Calling it in. Slow. Oh, there it is. Oh! Oh, oh! Oh, yes! you got it! <laughs> nice, Confirmed. You can use a crossbow to destroy a Hellstorm missile, but it's gonna be really hard to pull off in a public match. Let's try something easier. Myth. You can blow up a car with a crossbow. They're trucks. trucks. They're not even cars, mate. What are you talking about? Wait, is it steaming? It's steaming. I'm scared. Oh, oh my god! I... Yep. It can do it. <laughs> Confirmed. Try not to be too close to the truck. Myth. You can kill enemies with the crossbow underwater. Nice. Let's get some distance going. I know, chill. Hold on. Okay. Ah, yeah. my body just went like fucking flying. I know. The weird thing is that there's no slowdown. Confirmed. Wow, merch music. Everyone knew that was gonna work. You're so bad. Okay, calm down, Melvin. We're gonna get to the good stuff. Myth. You can survive getting one hit killed by the crossbow if you use kinetic armor. Are you ready? I'm good. Yep. And now. Neutralize. You shoot me okay. in the head? <laughs> I shot you in the tip. Busted. Kinetic armor users will still be one hit killed by the crossbow. But you can survive a crossbow shot if one of your legs is sticking through the wall, right? Ooh. Oh my god, that body twitch though. <laughs> what are you doing? Busted. You can shoot at- Oh my god, Merc! I knew that was gonna happen! Alright, fine. Let's try something that's fucking impossible to do. Myth. The mothership can't be destroyed by the crossbow. This'll shut Melvin up. Hi, Mom. Mothership is so huge. <laughs> he said, hi, Mom. Uh, <laughs> Dead? No. Dad, you? <laughs> the father ship. Oh, this is a perfect spot. Holy shit, dude. All right, and Take me with you! Shoot it. Unleash the power of the crossbow. <laughs> All right, quickly, quickly. Keep shooting it. <gasps> There's a decent amount of damage. It's like a third of the way. Or, yeah, third <laughs> of the way there. Oh, oh. oh, man. Making noises. Oh, get in there. Yep. <gasps> I got it! Oh, Dang, dude. It didn't even explode, nice. though. Nice! That was so weird. Busted. You can destroy a mothership with the crossbow, but you're going to need an army of crossbows to do so. The crossbow is looking a little OP right now. Is there anything that can stop it? Myth. Firebreaks heatwave can destroy incoming crossbow bolts. Ow. I think, I think you destroyed some of them. You destroyed about four of them, so that's pretty cool. You destroyed six that time. Nice. Confirmed. Just be aware that you won't be able to stop 12 incoming rounds from someone else's akimbo crossbows. But let's see what else Heatwave can stop. Myth. You can't survive getting stuck by a Simtex by using Heatwave to destroy it. Stick me good. Are you ready? Stick me. Well then. Busted. If you get stuck with a Simtex, you can use Heatwave to survive. But can you use Heatwave to destroy Reaper's Psychosis clones? Heatwave, Heatwave can destroy the clones? Yeah. Fuck yeah, I can. We don't know that. I do. Watch. Ready? Doesn't or destroy not. him. Told you. <laughs> Busted. You can't use Heat Wave to destroy the clones. So if Heat Wave can't destroy clones, but it can destroy crossbow bolts, can it save you from a rocket launcher? Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm supposed to be prepared for <laughs> Alright, we'll just do three, two, one. Go. Oh my god, dude. It can't save you? No. Unfortunately, you can't save yourself from a rocket launcher with Heat Wave. But can you at least use Heat Wave underwater? Alright. Three. All right. Two, one. Yeah, it'll stun me. Oh, Fuck. the crossbow works underwater. Yeah, we know that. Oh, you got me right in the fucking that. head, dude. Confirmed. Heat wave will stun enemies that are underwater. Let's end the video with something completely random. Myth. You can hit a silent shot in Black Ops 3. You know how to do it, right? You just snipe and then hold the yeah. combat axe right after. Okay. Mm, that's not a silent shot. It does do the animation like it's a silent shot, but it's just not. Yeah, yeah. Nope. 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 But. 
nope. plausible. It looks like a silent shot would be possible in Black Ops 3, but it seems like the combat axe does not pull out fast enough. And since the mechanics are almost identical to the way it works in Black Ops 2, I don't want to confirm or deny something that could happen. Plus, we only tested it with the Locust. Well, that's going to wrap it up for this Black Ops 3 Mythbusters video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did it and you'd like to see some more Black Ops 3 Mythbusters, make sure to drop a like. And if there are any myths that I didn't cover in this video and you'd like to see me covered in another Black Ops 3 Mythbusters video, make sure to leave a comment saying myth and then whatever the myth is. But yeah, thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you guys later. I don't need a dime, bitch, I'm still a high roller.